It's your boy Wiz Capone back with another video and today I'm going to be talking about why consistency and per perseverance leads you to success in it. You get me? First off, I want to start off by saying Red Bull sponsor me in it car. Man bats these on a daily in it, you get me? Oh fam, too nice fam. Yeah man, that sponsor needs to come, you get me? But yeah, anyway, man, enough of that. Back to like the main reason why I'm doing this video. So you get me? Why I believe um why I believe consistency and perseverance would lead you into big like big things is because with consistency, yeah, like a lot of people think, like for example, me and YouTube, yeah, like I'm not doing YouTube because of views and and that obviously the views and that is nice in it like it's good to get views it's good to get the right amount of likes which helps pushes your videos and all of that but i'm not doing it for that in it i'm just doing it for the passion i'm just doing it for the interaction with my audience the people that subscribe to me like that sort of vibe in it you feel me i would never do something like you get me that i don't really want to do for the sake of just doing it and i'm not going to sit here and lie and say the money is not important because at the end of the day the money is important but at the same time that can't be the main reason why you're doing something and if the money comes then the money comes sort of vibe in it you get what i'm trying to say and yeah man there's been a lot of people that when i started this youtube journey that wrote me off straight away but you see me i don't give a damn fam because you see me like i'm very tough skinned in it i don't care what the next man thinks about me i don't let other people like dishearten me with what whatever craft I want to chase or whatever craft I want to pursue or make that my full-time career sort of thing I would never let it get to me because I know those same people that are doubting you when you get somewhere with let's just say me I get somewhere with my YouTube career they would start saying oh I always believed you can do this I always believe you can do that and a lot of people that are successful can relate to what I'm saying in it you get me where it's like people that didn't want to give you the time of day and now that you're doing um, big things they want to act like they always knew you then they're always acting you in stories saying yo um, bro i always knew you can do it these times it was the complete opposite people are mad funny like that you get me people are funny like that man and yeah like in terms of consistency why you need to be consistent is because back to my point i was making before if I'm making videos and not many people are um are not liking it or subscribing, that doesn't mean I stop. I will still continue and continue and continue and continue. If things start to pick up, then so be it. But I'm not in a rush to be like, ah, oh, why are my numbers not going up? Why are my views like this? Why like do you know what I mean? Like because if that's your uh, mindset behind things, then you're you're in the wrong profession. You get me? Even things like comments, whether it will be on youtube or it would be on my instagram i've even had one or two bad comments on my um on my youtube on my youtube channel even though the majority of the comments are really nice but it's one of them ones where i know when you're doing youtube the bigger you get it comes with the territory in it so i'm one of those people where if someone comments a bad comment i don't let it outweigh the good ones in it because the good ones are the ones that keeps me going on at the end of the day, that keeps me strong to, to keep bringing all these videos out for you guys. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, man. Like, never in life, yeah, never follow or never let someone dishearten you, innit? You get me? Never let anybody dishearten you because when you let them dishearten you, they, they win. You get me? You have to rise above it. I know it's easier said than done, but at the same time, nothing in life comes to you easy you have to work for it and at the same time as well you can't feel sorry for yourself you can't blame other people you have to blame yourself because you see part of maturing it comes with taking self-acknowledgement it comes with taking responsibility for your own actions fuck what everybody else did look where you've gone wrong you get me if you can acknowledge acknowledge that that's the first steps you know what i mean once all of that's happened then you you start to graft, you start to hustle into your craft. Like, like for example, me, I started off with like, I don't know, like a hundred and something um, subscribers prior. But that's because 
like I was like getting all my close ones to subscribe for me, like all these good things in it. That was a big hustle. But I also knew that after all of that, man's gonna bring out bare videos because at the time I wasn't not that I was disheartened, but I just wasn't ready. I didn't feel like it was the right time to bring out videos. Whereas now I'm in my bag right now, innit? Man's in my bag right about now. So it's one of them ones where I'm gonna keep putting out videos for for my peoples, man. You get me? Whether it'll be about conscience videos, whether it'll be fun videos, challenges, like everything, everything's gonna like be coming to the channel, innit? You get me? Everything. Everything you would like to see, I would bring it because at the end of the day, you can't you can't be like limited at the end of the day because when you're limiting yourself you're limiting yourself to a lot of things whereas if you're open-minded and you're listening to other people's advice good advice by the way within reason it helps you as a person like a lot of people think oh wow i don't want to listen to this person because this person's chatting shit or did it did it xyz no sometimes when someone's telling you something you listen because it could it could benefit you as a person and help you go far do you know what I mean? I'm not even just talking me. I'm talking people in general. All, it's always good to um, listen to people because a lot of people think, rah, because I'm older than the person, I'm not going to listen to them. Or because um, that person's younger than me, um, it, it's not about age you know, at the end of the day. It's not about age. Like, you get me? It doesn't come with age. Like, even people that are in their 40s, they're still learning every day. Do you know what I mean? They're still learning something new. So don't be ignorant. Always open your eyes or open your ears even to other people when they're saying stuff to you because it can help you. It can benefit you in the long run as well. And yeah, with um, perseverance, yeah, never let anybody tell you that you're not worth anything. It's up to you as a human being to have in your mind that, nah, I've come into this world because man serves a purpose, isn't it? At the end of the day, you feel me? It's up to you to have that drive, have that passion, all of that to keep on going. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, like I said before, I'm like the way this world is is so fucked. Like no one's gonna pick you up and say, "Ah, oh, no, bro, you can do better." Not many friends are out there like that nowadays. Whereas me, I'm built different. For example, me and my boy, um, Artrizzi, yeah. Obviously, I know you wouldn't mind me saying this or anything like that, but you see me, when I got friends, yeah, I'm not the sort of person to just sugarcoat things and just agree with you because you're saying certain things. I'll be like, yeah, 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 yeah. It's not adapting and it will never be that. Me, when I have friends, I like to give them my honest opinion. I also like to give, like, I also like to say things that will challenge them, keep them on their toes, do what they need to do. Because at the end of the day, if you're not trying to like motivate your friends to come on the same journey, not the same journey because everyone has their own journey, but if you're not trying to like motivate your friend to kind of like want to do well, then you're not his friend. You get me? I'd rather someone tell me the truth than lie to me. You get me? Obviously, yeah, the truth may hurt like initially, but the truth is the truth at the end of the day. You can't, you can't run away from the truth. You get me? They always say the truth sets you free. Once you take that acknowledgement, once you take that initiative initiative to make that steps, yeah, to go forward with your life and start to change things and start to make changes, then that's a start, isn't it? That's where it starts. And also as well, the people that are following you, like for example, my subscribers, I would always be nice to people because that also helps my channel grow, not just me promoting it on social media and stuff like other things help as well and that's like one of the factors that i feel like that will benefit me in the long run too you get me but yeah man literally i feel like er en anybody can do whatever they set their mind to but it's it's up to you to be strong as a person do you know what i mean nothing's easy you have to keep going you have to keep pushing yourself at the end of the day you have to keep pushing yourself because yeah haters are people are gonna hate you but that's normal. You think all these celebrities that flipping um, make rap tunes or whatever sort of music they make, they don't get haters. Everybody gets haters. It's normal. But it's how you deal with it at the end of the day. It's how you deal with it and overcome it. But yeah, man, before I go as well, um, 
make sure to leave a like on the video comment on the video leave suggestions and what sort of content you would like to see me bring to the channel also um don't forget to um share the video on instagram whatsapp snapchat like all the good stuff in it obviously this is just the beginning isn't it like you feel me this is just the beginning so everyone needs to put their seat belts on and that you get me because at the end of the day man's here to stay in it i'm not stopping videos anytime soon in it because without consistency how do you expect to get anywhere in it yeah there's going to be times where you're going to have a slow period in it but it's up to you because when you have a, that slow period it's there to test you whether it's meant for you or not you get me like i said like there's many people that get into this industry for the wrong reasons you feel me? And that's it's, it's not like that. It shouldn't be like that. You have to have that mindset where you're doing it for the people. You're doing it because you're passionate about it. You feel me? But yeah, man, other than that, it's been your boy with Capone. Man, I'm out.